Brad over at Home Team Inspection Service, Samantha, sent us this email, and I, I just found it fascinating. Um, she says she read an article that says she should put dish detergent, the stuff that you wash dishes with in the sink, into her toilet. Apparently, the soap contains cleaning agents, the same ones that tackle food and grime on dishes, can also clean toilet bowls. And she's wondering, does anyone know if this is true? And on a separate note, I have a question, a follow-up on my own. But, but let's go with the dishwashing soap first. Thoughts about that? I don't know. I this is this is the first I've heard of that little trick. Uh, you know, I'm thinking about what bathroom chemicals actually are. I mean, they tend to be a little bit caustic, uh, a little bit. Um, you know, they're a little harsh. I don't mm-hmm. think that's something that you would find with a dish soap that's made to cut grease. I can't think of that many greasy type of things that are in your toilets. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. I'm not I'm not sure I've got a, a, a good answer on that one. I haven't tried that one out myself for sure. But we don't well, think it's good. You go ahead, Carson. Yeah, I was going to say, Bob, just from a legal standpoint, though, I'm not really sure that that's the intended use of that product. And I think that's where Brad was going at. Mm-hmm. It's dishwashing detergent, not toilet cleaning detergent. Um, also, I can tell you for all the listeners, don't ever try to put dishwashing liquid in the dishwasher. Yeah. I learned my lesson with that. Bubbles galore. It makes it, a, for a great bubble bath on the kitchen floor. It's yeah. amazing bubble bath. I've seen that a few times. So, yeah. I mean, theoretically, if you poured enough in it, I suppose that could happen in the toilet as well, which yeah. doesn't sound fun unless you're a toddler. No, yeah. but, but it, I guess where we're going with this, it can't hurt the toilet, uh, the pipes, right? Just to, if I, you no, I mean, it, yeah. I, don't, okay. I don't think it would hurt pipes or toilets. I mean, not with not with porcelain. You know. Yeah, the, there are a lot of these secondhand remedies, things that people are pushing around the internet and uh, writing about. So here's my follow-up. So uh, for those of you who don't know, I got married a couple of weeks ago. It's fabulous. I love uh, LaDonna, and she's an incredible person. We had this conversation briefly, but I wanted to, this really leads into this. And I said, so I have these blue tablets you put in the toilet tanks and it uh, puts blue in the water which I kind of liked, I guess. And she said, eh, I'm not a big fan. So I wondered, is there a, and you can buy these through Amazon or in the store, you know, is there an, does it do anything? Is there, is it a cleaning detergent or do you, does it hurt anything? What are your thoughts? No, I don't think it hurts anything. I think the only thing that it does, I mean, there are one, there are products that are actually clear in color uh, that do that. They deodorize. I think that's one of the the bigger things that they're doing for you. Uh, I mean, yeah, the, you know, blue water is great for uh, like little kids, like Cora just said. But yeah, I don't know that your big advantage. Maybe it's a little bit of uh, freshness with every flush, as they say. But oh, okay. Yeah. That might be your only benefit. Maybe it's just psychological. I like the blue could water. Maybe yeah, yeah, it could have been. Could yeah. Be. So it's calming. It's calming. It's cool. It's calming. There we go. Meanwhile, I've got this box of these tablets I bought, and if she doesn't want me to put them in, I'm not going to put them in. Maybe I'll bring them to the office. We'll put them in the bathroom there here. Let me have at the office. Uh, a reminder, if you're thinking of selling your home now or in the future, we have a free no-obligation booklet that has hundreds of useful tips. Want a copy? Simple. Send an email, bob at com, and put selling tips in the subject line. And on that same note, if you're getting ready to sell your home, our home team inspection service has an inspection guide, uh, what to expect during a home inspection. Same thing. Send an email, bob at com with inspection in the subject line. I'll send that right out to you. 